today monet here and i am back with another video all right guys so today we are at kfc they got some beyond fried chicken that you know i had to get to the bottom of you know is it given to infinity and beyond well, i don't know look if you want to know like i know then stay tuned because we're about to get right into the video all right y'all we in line okay we is in line the line is moving nice and slow it is nice and slow how are you today? How are you doing? Could I get your um Beyond Fried Chicken combo? Six or twelve? Uh, six. Pepsi for your drink? Uh, can I get the Orange Mountain Dew? Anything else for you today? What's the size that comes? Fresh. What is it? Fresh or you can change it. Oh, I'll do fries. That's fine. All right, anything else? That's it. All right, eight forty-seven. All right, thank you. <laughs> I will not say anything that I am thinking right now because I'm gonna be quiet. How are you? Hi. Day 47. Can I get some? Yes. Can I get some KFC and barbecue sauce? Yes. Thank you. Take it out. Thanks. Oh, we're out of here. All right, child. Let me put on my hand sanitizer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Woo! All right, here we go. Let me get you a close-up. Hey, so this is the packaging. You know they going green or whatever. You know, beyond fried chicken. Let's open this thing on up. Okay, hold up. They look a little, they look a little bit kind of real though. All right, it look good. I got the six piece with the fries. Let's really get into it though. All right, here it is right here, y'all. Now, now I eat chicken. So I could tell you if it really tastes like chicken or not. I don't think it's supposed to though. Let's get a close up on this thing for real. Oh, we got a little lightly toasted. It's a little lightly toasted. All right, Ooh, I'm gonna try it with no um sauce. I hope they ain't changed the recipe because one thing about KFC, keep the recipe the same. It's heavier though. This is heavy. This got a little weight to it. Crunch. ridges and everything in it. Y'all, this is good. What? That's not real? It's an imposter. Oh my God, hold on. These not real ill? Because let me tell you something you can't be doing. You can't give me no Beyond Fried Chicken and then be deep frying my fries in real fried chicken grease. Ain't nobody think about that though. Because I know that fried chicken grease anyway. And it's on them fries. This, however, is had me fooled. Fool me once. Shame on you. Wow, y'all. This tastes so real. This bomb. I'm enjoying it. All right. Okay, let's get into some textures. The texture of the nugget is spot on. Nice and crunchy on the outside. Well seasoned. On the inside, I can tell a little bit when I bite into it that it's not real meat. Real chicken, you know what I'm saying? But hell, what is real chicken these days? We don't know what we be eating. Taco Bell just came out with chicken wings. Do we know? Do we, was it back there when they gathered the chicken up? We don't know what we, what's real chicken these days. You feel me? But the texture is a little bit, mm, if you've ever been into like tofu, it ha, it kind of has like that texture of like tofu, but it does not taste like tofu, although tofu doesn't taste like anything. I like it. But something about this, Make me feel like it may have been dibbling and dabbling with the real with the real chicken. Something about this gives me only a dab would do with that chicken. Why? Mm-hmm. It got 
got a little hint of I've been around on it. I can feel it. I can feel it. It's been mixing and mingling with that chicken up in there. I know it has. I can tell. This is some KFC sauce, y'all. This sauce is bomb. Let me tell you that right now. This sauce is bomb. Mm. Look, I won't tell if you won't. This is good. Can you put some of that sauce on there? What y'all talking about? Got me wanting to make life changes and stuff. It ain't that bad. It really ain't that bad. They did a really good job. They did a good job. Because y'all know. I done tasted every chicken sandwich known to mankind. So at this point, I'm more of a chicken connoisseur. You know what I'm saying? I know. I know chicken when I see chicken. And this one right here had me fooled. Stomped. I wouldn't know the difference. Mm, 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 mm. The only thing is when you bite into it, it's a, it's a thicker consistency. But not too thick, but it's a thicker consistency. Man. Y'all be eating chicken breast. And not only is it a thicker consistency, but it be dry. It be so dry. And somebody always want to order up a, a breast. They don't be good. They don't be good. They be dry. They be hurting going down. If, if you can knock back a biscuit from anywhere, just throwing them back. No, no water, no nothing. You'll be just fine, okay? This chicken nugget ain't putting up that much of a fight at all. So if you could do that with no problem be the main ones complaining i just i can't i can't do it child please you know we don't know what we eating anyway See, let me leave y'all alone let me show y'all this stuff these chicken nuggets from a scale to one to five five being hell yeah one being no i'm good mm -hmm. 4.5 2.5. Y'all, this is good. This is dropping everywhere now. Wait a minute. I seen it happen the first time. Maybe even the second time, but the third time is too much. Oh my God. This time drop again, I never eat it again. The texture is a little unique. Not in a bad way, it's just different. But the flavor... The way it's packed with flavor like that. Okay, KFC, I see you. Y'all definitely got to try that, for real. Look, I'm going to head out, y'all. But before I do, you know I got to leave you with a little uh-uh-uh-uh-uh. <laughs> I'm going to tell y'all this. I heard something today, listening to my word this morning, because you know I need my word every morning. You hear me? And it really said, people kind of go into the new year, making all these goals for themselves as far as you know i want to lose this amount of weight i want to make this amount of money by this time just a list of things uh more so tangible things not realizing that the true change has to be your mental your mental is what's going to bring on the weight loss allow you to be in rooms where you can make that amount of money you have to change your mindset we are already conditioned to operate in certain ways as is. The thing that needs to change is how you think, what you believe, how strong is your faith, how far are you willing to go? Is this just a goal that you're trying to achieve or are you committed to it? Because there's a clear difference. If it's a goal, you're just going to do what you need to do to achieve it. You're committed to it. You're going to do anything and everything possible to make it happen. And that's the difference. And that comes with changing your mindset. And that's really what I want to tell you guys today. Any goals or anything that you guys are trying to accomplish, try to figure out what is it about me that I need to change first so that it can be more tangible, so that it can be easier. It's easy to say you want to do all of these things. It's harder to change habits. Okay. Keep in mind, it only takes 30 days to change a habit, baby. After that, you good money. All right, well, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Also, hit that notification bell so you'll know every time I upload. Until next time, guys, peace.